Hello and welcome to Let's Talk Meshing's Tutorial Tuesday, where we explore a feature in just a couple of minutes. Today we're going to learn about simple hyperbolic extrusions. Extrusions are a very useful feature in PointWise, and I'm going to show you how to set them up for 2D and 3D. Our first example is on a simple 2D airfoil. Let's extrude the surface into a far field. Now this particular airfoil is from the very first PointWise tutorial, which is installed with every copy of PointWise. Step one is to select all of the connectors. Then go to the Create menu, Extrude, Normal, and push Done. Click on the Attributes tab. We want our step size to start out with 0 0.0001. Now, note that the orientation of the arrows is going the wrong direction. We want it to extrude outward, so I'm going to push the Flip button. Now we go over to the Run tab. I'm going to type in 91 steps for this example, and then push the Run button. Now if we zoom out, you can see that it has extruded the surface all the way out to a circular far field. This is an example of a 2D extrusion. Now let's take a look at a 3D extrusion. We're going to take this 10 by 10 domain and extrude it normal to the surface. First of all, select the domain, click on the Create menu, Extrude, Normal, click on the Attributes tab. The initial delta S in this example is going to be 0 0.5. Now click on the Run tab, and let's type in just 10 steps, and push the Run button. Let's take a look at this. And there you go, we used a simple hyperbolic extrusion to take that domain and extrude it into a three-dimensional block. You've now seen two examples of simple structured hyperbolic extrusions. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, drop us a line down below or connect with us on Twitter, which is linked in the description. Thank you and have a pleasant Tuesday.